As we wait for a decision on Moderna today, hundreds of healthcare workers in Delaware got the Pfizer vaccine, Christiana Care Health System. We're on NBC10 Delaware reporter Tim Furlong inside for an all access look at the vaccine and what they do with it from freezer to shoulder. After months of talking about it, it's pretty powerful to watch the first Christiana Care doctors and nurses finally getting the vaccine in their shoulder. They go see the vaccinator, and when they are done, they get what is likely to be the most coveted sticker in the world the one that says, I got my COVID 19 vaccine. Nurse Michelle Dew among the first of 456 Christiana Care employees to get the vaccine on day one. We do have a higher risk exposure with intubations on COVID patients, so we want to be extra careful. It's, it's safe, it's effective. I'm excited uh, when it's my turn to get uh, the vaccine. I, I will step up and and uh, bear my arm and get the shot. Okay, so we have two different sets of freezers that we purchased for Christiana Care. The Christiana Hospital now has huge freezers. Some kept ultra cold for the 3,400 Pfizer vaccines they received, and some less cold for the Moderna vaccines they expect next week. Once it's go time, they open up the boxes and get them down to a lab to be thawed, mixed, and ready for use. To start, Christiana Care is randomly selecting from doctors, nurses, and support staff who have the most contact with patients. It's a little pain on my arm, but I'm okay. After the employees get their shot, they are observed for a few minutes to make sure they're okay. They also book an appointment to get their second dose. I mean, this is really the light at the end of the tunnel for the pandemic. She's right, it is, and it is expected to increase confidence and decrease anxiety for frontline health care workers. But with another holiday surge expected, you and me, we can't let our guard down or our masks. And leaders here at Delaware's largest private employer say they are absolutely convinced the vaccine works and that it's safe. You know, fast food, junk food, there's things that we put in our, uh, in our body every day that are less safe than this vaccine. Hopefully this is now the beginning of the end of the global nightmare. In Newark, Tim Furlong, NBC10 News. Meantime, the first employees at Children's Hospital of Philadelphia also got their first dose of the COVID-19 vaccine today. Hospital staff will continue to be vaccinated over the next few weeks. Inspira Health also administered COVID-19 shots to its frontline health care staff this morning in South Jersey. The organization plans to vaccinate thousands of health care workers in the next three weeks. Hospitals across New Jersey have also started vaccinating the nurses and doctors who've been right there on the front lines during this entire pandemic. New Jersey Governor Phil Murphy says this is just the start of creating protection from the virus all across the state. Each day this week, the number of vaccinated New Jerseyans has grown, but it is still a drop in a very big bucket. For us to get to the point where we know there is broad statewide protection against this virus, we need millions of 